Hello everyone, great to be with you from Stamford Bridge. This is Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It's Chelsea up against Bayern Munich. Well, Derek, with the final so close, really important for both sets of players to stay in the now. Block the final out of the mind. Stay in the semi-final and do your job. And number 11, Pedro. Oh, quite simply, we always expect Bayern to be competing for the Champions League. It was a painful semi-final experience in 2018, you might remember. They felt they didn't deserve to go out at the hands of Real Madrid, the eventual winners. No, and you've got to use those experience in your advantage. You've got to look at that game. What didn't they do well? What did they do well? Put it all into a game plan. Go out and put the record straight. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Can they spot at home? Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Kepa is given the green light in goal. Andreas Christensen plays with Kurt Zuma in central defence. Jorginho plays with Ngono Conte in the centre of the park. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Well, he was a Champions League runner-up in his Borussia Dortmund days, Robert Lewandowski, and still one of the best in the business when it comes to plundering. Well, centre-forward play doesn't come much better than this guy. He's a dying breed, there's not many of his type around. Scores with both feet, heads goals, tap-ins, shots from outside the box. Tolisso with the feed. Well, first-rate goalkeeping. Oh, you can't believe the goalkeeper saved that, that's brilliant. Options in the centre. Gnabry, he's got himself away from the touchline, Coutinho, not far away at all with the volley. Well, to catch it like that, you've got a really good technique, and oh, so close. This is Aspili Quetta, Jorginho, Conte, Jorginho. It's with Emerson, showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Chelsea couldn't keep it. Coutinho. Toliso. Here is Joshua Kimmich. Bayern moving the ball around and getting deep into opposition territory. Kimmich didn't quite do enough. Well, that's clear. And they've gone for the short corner. Teammate in support. As an attacking player, you rather hope you'll get the decision in your favour, but offside here. Yeah, the defence got that spot on, and so did the linesman. Here is Zuma. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Pedro. And the cross into the middle. Still alive. Over the touchline for a throw in. Aspili Quetta now. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Gnabry with it. Gnabry. And the ball has been Equesa. And you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that. And Bayern, the recipients of the free kick here. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Not a good pass. Magnificent challenge to win it back. This might be ideal for the counter. And the counter-attack came to nothing. 
Thiago. Tolisso. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Quick thinking defensively, Aspili Quetta. And the counter looks on here. Options available. End product or not? Zulu stops it. Tolisso. Coutinho. And so the first half draws to a close. Second half of this Champions League semi final first leg underway. There's a thorough understanding of defending Aspili Quetta. Dangerous looking through ball. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. It is now with Jorginho. Great reflex action from Neuer. Pedro responsible for the corner. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. And let's get your assessment, Lee, on Robert Lewandowski. Has he given enough? Well, it's not been a great first half of football as far as he's concerned. He seemed a little bit sluggish to me, Derek. Easy for the back line to pick him up. Needs more movement. Well, they put the pressure on. It was only a matter of time before they scored the goal. Well, here's the replay. Defenders don't like it when he goes to wide areas because they know what's going to happen. The ball's going to come into the box, and on that occasion, it comes in, and now they're picking it out the back of the net. And Bayern will change personnel now. So, back underway. Bayern leading here. Substitution for FC Bayern. Regain possession. Coming off the pitch. Number 10. And it's with Pedro. To be replaced by. Well, he took care of it defensively. Conte. Ball lost by Chelsea. Half an hour remaining then. Lewandowski. Breaking at pace. There's so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Here is Thiago. He's using his strength to good effect. Lost possession. Jorginho. Pedro. Dangerous looking attack. Run it magnificently and intercepted. Thiago. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. And a throw in forthcoming. FC Bayern Munich. It's a substitution for Bayern. Number 24, Corentin Talisa. To be replaced by number 25. Jorginho. Pedro. With an excellent understanding defensively. Thiago. Couldn't hang on to it. Chelsea getting the ball forward. What can they do from this position? A chance to level it. Surely it wasn't far away from the target, Lee. No, it was decent. Really, really decent chance for the lad. They'll keep pushing away to try and get that equaliser. Kimmich with it. This is Müller. Here is Joshua Kimmich. A foul, but advantage, Bayern. Thiago. Goretzka. Lewandowski. And Thiago. Thiago! And the ideal finish from the Bayern point of view. What a goal that is. It was just a matter of time before it happened.
Well, it's good play. Ian Wright always told me, stand in the middle of the goal. It sounds simple, but you don't have to get a lot of goals from that position. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, a second goal for them here. Substitution for Chelsea. Coming off the pitch, number five. What sort of trick does Pedro have up his sleeve from here? And blocking from Zule. And Kovacic seeing his pass intercepted. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Goretzka. Given away by Bayern Munich. This is Alaba. We have entered the final minute of normal the time. As indicated, there will be a minimum. Mateo Kovacic. And now William coming into it. They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline in this game. And this could be a dramatic finale. Well, here is the replay. It's a good goal, isn't it? It gives them a glimmer of hope. But you have to say, they haven't been good enough today. I think it's too little too late, Derek. We have it. 2-1. Goal for Chelsea. Number 10. William. And the referee blows his whistle. That is the end of the contest. And a fine result for the away fans. And if they can repeat this sort of performance on home soil, then they will surely be going through. Well, Derek, going into the second leg of the semi-final, you've got to remind yourself of the scoreline. You have a small advantage. Can you keep that? Can you keep your nerve? only 90 minutes away from that golden final.